Hello, my spacefaring love children. Mmm, me and a hooker just pooped you right out of her space vag, and now you're here watching my videos just like Daddy wants. Worst intro ever. And uh, hey guys, I'm Esh, and this is uh, this is Star Maid. We're back, and as you can see, I've been building a little bit, but I was really thinking back to my first days in Star Maid whenever I before I started recording. When I was just a fledgling young spacefaring son of a bitch. And I was thinking, oh, you know what? Advanced build mode. That's a cool thing. Yeah, I wanna be I wanna be doing that. If you uh if you build a ship with a ship core, which you sh should be uh familiar with doing by now, I'm sure, then you know you can enter build mode in your ship. That is my ship, it's just floating a single cube, depressingly f just hanging out in space while we build our masterpiece, the, the the juggernaut that is going to be the space station. And when you enter when you enter build mode, you can hit, uh, if you look at the right side of your screen there, um, you can see it says press control to enter advanced build mode. And if you hit control, it'll bring up some new settings and you can move your mouse over there and set things. Um, I was wondering, how can I make that a reality for something that isn't a ship and is instead a space station or perhaps a planetary structure of some sort? Well, in the case of the space station, you need a little block called a building block, or a build block, rather. You can buy these at your, your, uh, your shops, and it looks just almost just like a space core or a ship core, like that so, but it's not animated. Just a little block. And then, once you have that, you can R on it. You get to, you place it on whatever structure you want to build, obviously. Then you R on it, and it'll put you into build mode based on what you have it attached to. So since I've attached the build block, I'm in build mode. I can use advanced build mode, which is the best. It's like cheat building. Look at this. Okay, so I'm going to show you how to do it. Um... See, as you can see, whenever I have it normal, I'm just one blocking in here. I can one block here if I want. And while it is easier in build mode in general, by being able to float in sort of an out-of-body experience through space and build and attach blocks, it's not exactly incredibly fast. And for something this big, of this magnitude, pop, pop, you want something a little bit quicker. And that's where advanced build mode comes into play. You hold control down and it gives you some axes here. Um, you have X, Y, and Z. And if you're familiar with any sort of, really, any sort of geometry, I guess, then you know that this means X axis, Y axis, and Z axis. Now, right now, I have it set for 6, 1, and 4. 6 being, as you can see, if I hold down control and then I highlight you can see this large area is set up that's a six by four by one area based on this, the settings I have in there so if I click now boom that whole area is now filled in with whatever I have selected in my hotbar which in this case is gray hull pieces now if I wanted to make it a different size I'll go up here and I would just adjust it and now as you can see it's a cube because I've added some y-axis unfortunately I'm still having some issues with where I'm supposed to be clicking. For instance, I'm, I'm having to click above the arrows to click on the actual arrow. Otherwise, I accidentally mess up other axes and so forth. If you're having that problem, I apologize. I don't really know what to do. I haven't really looked it up, to be honest. It's not a huge deal because you're not really using the uh, UI a whole lot other than hotkeys. Now, let's say I want to just... just own this space station. I can just pump this x-axis up to 10, which seems to be the max, but that's fine, because look at this. All of a sudden, we're filling the crap in. We're pushing it in. We're making this a reality at a pace that no human could ever aspire to do. It's just nuts. It's, if you're familiar with Minecraft mod, uh, what the hell is it called? It's oh, crap. It's called like I haven't played. I haven't had to mess with it in forever. Uh, I think it's MC Edit. It's it's a, like the most popular admin mod ever created. It runs on Bucket, 
And if you're familiar with the quick building abilities you have in that son of a gun, then you know you can build things like this at a, an increasingly alarming rate. So it shouldn't be anything new to you, uh, you, uh, you well-versed son of a bitches. But for some people, this is new, and all you need to do is familiarize yourself with some basic geometry. And uh, let me just say, building a platform like this is incredibly easy. Now, the one thing I'm not sure about, let's see how much it takes away from our numbers here. Okay, we have 382. This should take away 40, so we should be at 342. Boom, okay, now it takes away 40. So if this thing takes away just enough to fill in this little hole or the entire amount and doubles over, we'll know if it's 302 or less or more than 302. Boom, okay, so it only takes the amount it actually needs to fill in the hole that is in question. So that's really good. So that makes things a lot easier for me. Now, we can just own. This is going to be awesome. Now, unfortunately, I still don't have quite enough uh, gray hole pieces, even though I've just absolutely been mining the crap out of this stuff. I'm going to have to go back out to the derelict space stations of the universe and get some more gray uh, skull, skull, gray skull. Yes, I'm going to have to go out to the in, out outer space, find gray skull, and then turn his body into some sort of building block so that I can build my space station. But in reality, all I need to do here, oh, look at this, just like Tetris, Jesus. Okay, so we're, we're out of, we're out of blocks here. Okay, so. But look at that, look at how fast we just filled in like a huge chunk of this. As soon as I have enough gray hull, this thing is going to be done. This platform is going to be done. Okay, so, what we have so far, we have a huge ass platform. I've started building, sorry, I'm giving getting Facebook uh, messages out of the butt because, um, you know, I just put up a new uh, profile picture. It's, uh, it's just a really close up of my beard. You can't even tell who it is. It's just... Um, really really like microscopic view of like my bristly beard hairs it's pretty much the sexiest thing I've ever I've ever you know been a part of or even seen really and I've seen a lot of sexy things let me tell you my life is just basically one big sexy thing and uh, this this just absolutely tops it so what we're doing here also we need to make sure that we have a, the sweet ass blue accent lines Sort of like racing stripes for your spaceship here. We want to make sure. Now, if we wanted to make this faster, obviously, we can turn this baby down so that it's just one block and just make this as long as we can. Alright, so we just put it like this. That's not the right way, is it? Alright, so we need to... Dang it. We're going to have to do something about this. Okay, we can just do that and then we'll just remove the excess. All right. Now there's other things you can do with this. Um, you can do all sorts of stuff. Holy crap, I did not mean to do that. Oh, this is a huge ass thing here. Look at this. So you can do this. You can do this. This is what you can do with this. Click on block. I want to turn that off. Uh, basically, it just sets a plane as a certain block and that's just absolutely crazy. You can also do re remove mode where you can remove these chunks rather than them placing them. It's just the best. It's the best quite possibly above the goddamn rest. So that's really all you need to know, guys. It's really all you need to know. Really, that's real the main thing I wanted to show you guys is the, the that you can in fact enter advanced build mode or even a build mode in general on your space station or structure of some sort that's not a ship which can be confusing because I know most uh, tutorials start you off with a ship and from there you have to, you're you're just learning how to do a ship and it's not not as different as you might think friends oh, that's the wrong way that is the wrong way you would think after navigating minecraft with you would know what a, which axis is actually happening but you know, I don't I'm terrible at I'm terrible at this. So yeah, the, the Star Made a series is probably going to take a little bit of a uh, tutorial turn, as it may. 
because I think it's uh, deserving of uh, a tutorial series, whereas the Yogg uh, Craft series is more of an adventure. What is this? Oh, I, gotta, I forgot to show you guys this. I have no idea what, what really... Um, okay, so actually, I'm just going to go in here. I have the gravity set up, so I got my gravity going. Now, what do we have? First of all, we need some more light in this bitch. We need some more light in this bitch. Oh, God, I just messed up. I just messed up, guys. I just messed up so hard. Uh, we're going to place this again and not remove it. That should not be a thing. But it is a thing, guys. It is a thing. Okay. Okay, first of all, is this in my inventory? I think it is. I actually want these, so I'm going to leave that. Uh, Plex door, I actually want these. I'm going to leave that. Red hole, not so much here. Not so much. Cockpit, not. Nah, don't need it. Weapons computer, not yet. Ship core, not yet. Uh, not quite yet. Not yet. We're just putting all this stuff away. Uh, black hole, nah. I'm going to leave it the blue in here, though. Okay. Plex storage, put some plex storage in there, too. Okay, so I actually wanted to expand my door right now. We don't have any doors up. I've removed them. But now we're going to make some door here. So we're going to just place the crap out of this door. What is that? I don't want you. Maybe I do have a door. Dang it. I, maybe I didn't actually remove a door. Okay. Let's see if it works. Booyah! It works perfectly. Well, I say perfectly. It sort of vanishes into thin air. But, you know, for the sake of this, it pretty much works. Now, next time, we're going to have to finish our, our damn uh, sh lifter. I've got that area up there platformed out. Now I'm just going to have to make it so that the actual lift goes up into a square, into the open square so you can get off easily and so forth. Shouldn't be an issue. Oh yeah, I want to get my lights here. Come on. Let me put you in this. There we go. Put some more lights up around this room. It's getting kind of dark in here. I'm going to put one over... Should put these in the floor, maybe? I wonder if it lights up underneath this. Let's check it out, everybody. Boom. No, it does not. Alright, that's unfortunate. But, we can make do. We can, in fact, make do. So, I'm going to remove these and make it a little bit... Oh, holy crap. Those are extremely bright. Jesus. Okay. Doing the same thing over here. Over her. Okay, lit up a little bit, yeah, it's looking good. Let's put uh, one in this corner, maybe, and maybe another one over here, right below the blue lines, all around the room. That's fine, that's fine. We'll just put one here, boom, for temporary lighting. It looks crap, man, the shadows are casting, are crazy. We're going to have to put a ton of, of lamps in this place. And that, my friends, is another episode of Starmade, I think. We've done... Look at this. In the time... When I, look, I can just walk up and pop, pop. I'm in build mode. Oh, yeah. Look at this. And I can just go around once I have my gray uh, blocks and just build the crap out of this thing. It will definitely be done next episode. At least the platform and hopefully the building, this part of the building. Um... And we'll also have a working lift that goes all the way to the top. We'll move some of the computers around, perhaps. Maybe add a cockpit to this bad boy, even though it doesn't fly. That wouldn't make sense, actually. We're not going to put a cockpit in this. But we uh, I actually need to farm more Plex class for money, but also because we want to put some glass in this bad boy so we can be up in our command station and see out around us. And then we'll think about adding some weapon platforms of some sort to this bastard. And also, another huge piece of a space station is also going to be our shield system. And of course, anything we add to this, we're going to have to make sure we have adequate power to run it. So that's a thing. Yeah, that's a thing. And until next time, this has been a brief episode of Star Made. If you guys have any questions about advanced build mode... There are different blocks that you might need to build on a planetary surface in build mode. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave a comment. And until next time, this has been Ash playing some Star Made. 
Play on.